In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Minecraft server lag on Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Now, there's multiple reasons why you could be experiencing lag on these servers, but the main reason is typically due to Wi-Fi issues. And in this video, I'm going to be going over the best ways that you could optimize your Wi-Fi for Minecraft servers. Starting off with the server region. Now, some servers will actually have multiple different regions. And essentially, a region is where a server is set up. So I'm currently in a North America. So I would need to be in a North America lobby or server because it's if I try to go to like Asia or something like that, then I'm going to be experiencing significant lag. The Hive is one of these servers that does include region selectors. So all we need to do is we need to go over here and select on region selectors. Many other servers have this as well. Zika has a Qcraft, all that good stuff. Basically any big name server should have a region selector. And essentially you want to make sure that you do switch to the correct region. So as you're able to tell, we got Asia and Europe over here, which are actually not very optimal for me because if I were to go to these regions, I would experience significant lag, but just make sure that you are in the region closest to you so if you're from asia you want to go to the asia region if you're from europe then you want to go to the europe region all right so now we're going to go ahead and open up our device setting okay so here we are and the next thing you want to do is you actually want to go ahead and look up network like so network settings go ahead and press on that and then go ahead and select over here where it says data usage and over here it is going to show you the applications that are currently using the most wi-fi on your device so as you're able to tell uh yeah we do have a lot of different devices over here and essentially what you want to do is you want to delete the applications that are taking up an absurd amount of Wi-Fi or bandwidth. For example, Steam is taking up way too much Wi-Fi. So what I would need to do is I would need to uninstall Steam and then we would get better Wi-Fi because this will basically put less strain on our Wi-Fi if we do remove it. Next up, we have Ethernet. So Ethernet is incredibly useful. It is essentially a cable that connects your device directly to your Wi-Fi router. So if you are able to purchase an Ethernet cable or you maybe you have one lying around, then definitely go ahead and use it. I'll put some images on the screen like so, and it's incredibly fast. It's way faster than Wi-Fi, and it is incredibly reliable, and it is what I personally use for my device. And if you do have Ethernet, make sure over here where it says meter connection is actually turned off. We want that to be turned off in order for things to run smoothly. So some things that may hinder your Wi-Fi quality is the amount of devices that are currently connected to your Wi-Fi. So if you have like an absurd amount of devices connected to your Wi-Fi, then it actually could cause strain to your Wi-Fi and therefore cause you to lag in Minecraft servers. Additionally, if someone in your household is like uploading a video, for example, or maybe even streaming, that is also something that takes up a lot of bandwidth on your Wi-Fi. And if you're able to try to find a time where like maybe not many people are using your Wi-Fi, and then you should be able to experience better results from there. And obviously you want to make sure that you do have the most recent and up-to-date version of Minecraft. And also you want to make sure that the server you're playing on is updated as well, because sometimes lag could be caused by an issue with the server not necessarily with your Wi-Fi. So it could be that a server is experiencing some sort of glitch or anything like that. So those are just some things that you need to look out for. If you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. See you later, French fries.